So we're finally getting, well, I'm finally getting close to the fun part of the summer. I'm editing today's video on July 18th, 2019. And editing date that I'm editing it is September 25th, right? September 25th or 26th? 26th is a Thursday. I'm editing this video. So luckily I did a couple of videos based on what I was thinking, what I plan on doing. But today's video is dealing with uh, we're prepping for our first pink day right so for years my husband has been asking me to go camping and stuff like that and i'm always reluctant to go because of uh sanitary kind of thing so once i told him i was ready uh we could go or something like that he went crazy he went and buy a stove and all sort of things so this video is pretty much gonna highlight uh, our prepping time for our first camping day so please enjoy the video i will not be narrated too much because as i'm looking at some of the footage that i have here i've recorded a lot so i'll try my best to keep it short and uh, you guys could uh, go along with us so yeah we went crazy we did went crazy considering this first trip i i believe in one of the recording i said that uh, is a learning experience we took too many things we took too many things but i took as many things that i felt like i will need and i will learn from it when i'm at the when we actually camp well i'll see things that i don't really need and things that i i, I don't need to bring next time and things like that so this is a prepping for our first camping trip Thanks for watching. Take a moment, like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. It's about 4.30. I was thinking of going to the gym, but my husband has a day off today. And we have a couple things to do before we go on our camping trip tomorrow. So I probably will go to the gym a little bit later, like in the middle of the day. I'm up already. So let me try to go back to sleep again. So today is July 18, it's about 8.40 or 8.50, brush my teeth and uh, I got up earlier thinking should I go to the gym and I remember my husband is going to be home today so I didn't need to rush but tomorrow we are going on uh, our camping trip and we're coming back on Sunday so we have a lot of things to do put together and um, we have stuff my husband wants to go and donate some of the stuff that I picked up and gathered because we want to clear out the house and uh, I really want to get a workout in but at the same time now I'm lazy this is why when I get up and I say I'm going to the gym I just go but now I'm dragging myself uh, I didn't eat anything I didn't drink anything yet let me see what I'm gonna do, I don't know. I need to get those stuff out so when my husband is ready to take them to the Salvation Army so he could have them. All right, let me go do that. You keep peeling it, that's no, what. No, this? What, this here? Yeah. That's a mosquito bite and he's pe like keeps scratching it. Oh. Leave it alone. I didn't think, I thought it was your toes. Remember when no, we were- it was his toes. When we were walking to the that doesn't hurt. Pool? That itches, right, Mark? Mm -hmm. All right, so leave it alone. The hurt is on top of the toe. Oh, okay. And I, I didn't see that. When did you get that part? Uh, my oh. Now I see why. Uh, that is not the anymore. All right. So lower that thing, the TV. What? It's a mosquito bite. Everybody's getting the skittle bag. Alright, so we bought this. I think that's the stove my husband bought from went out of control with this camping thing. So bring this. So this is why I got my camera. Yeah, I know my husband's laughing at me. 
So we have, normally when we go out or when we get food delivered to us, we save uh, these forks, spoons, utensils, all of these. So now we're going camping. We don't want to bring the good stuff, our uh, utensils. So we're going to bring some of these. So, I have forks already, but I need spoons. Okay, this I need for my kids when they're going to school. Especially my youngest. Um, how do they call them? Those with the spoon and forks? Something like that. Michael had said it to me before. So I leave that for them too when they're going to school. Spork. So I thought I had spoon. Okay, there's a spoon, but it has. Okay. I think maybe it will. No. But I have to bring a spoon because they're going to be eating rice and stuff. Oh, we're bringing rice. We're going to cook it over there. We'll cook it here and then put it in the sun. Alright, so. Then I don't want to use a. We'll cook it tomorrow morning. Yeah, before we leave. Yeah, I don't want to use those forks because I want them. I think we're just bringing forks. We have a lot of forks, but the I thought we have just spoons. We don't. So what I already took, that's what I'm gonna bring. I want to leave the forks for them to go to school. Nah, so that's it. We just getting ready for mañana. We shall see how that goes. If it requires another, if we have a good time, we're probably gonna go again. Look at guns. I didn't buy all this stuff to do it one time, okay? <laughs> well, we shall see. Uh, okay, so what I'm doing here, I'm gonna start preparing the seasoning for the chicken that we're about to buy. That way, when I come, all I have to do is wash the chicken and put it in there, and then put the chicken in a Ziploc. For us to take so it's pretty simple I'm gonna put uh, a double good amount probably will add some more once I put the meat in there and some saison pepper parsley A little bit of salt, put a bit of that. and I'm gonna put some water in there. So that's it. I'll leave this like that when I buy the meat, wash it, put it in there, and I'm done with it. The plates we're bringing, we're bringing our worst, not the best we bring for us to eat over there. And these are my seasoning to put on my things cayenne pepper, cayenne pepper, and some. Uh, yeah, cayenne pepper. So, yep. Yeah. Oh, they both are the same. So, let me bring the smaller one. I'm gonna put them in a bag. And these we're bringing for extra if we need to cover stuff, things left over. So, we're bringing these. Alright, so these are the utensils. Just wash them again. We're gonna bring these. There's the plates and bowls we're bringing. So, I just wash these. These two spoons. Because I don't have any plastic spoons. Um, it's part it's not part of our set so i decided to bring this if we lose this at least we won't uh lose this part of the set there it is, there it is. like these these are the one we use this we don't use often so if we lose it we're going to we will not get feel bad that much so this is empty this is sugar for i guess uh tea and coffee and stuff all right so i put the sugar in here i don't have any more but that's the only amount we have some peppers ketchup and stuff like that so these goes in here uh, where is and this put this in there so that'll be like seasoning stuff in there so there it is so if any of these break at least the sugar will not get affected so yeah that's it okay everything in here then put them. and you guys may laugh at me but these are uh, you see mcdonald's uh napkins and stuff like that so we're bringing that too 
Um, there it is. These are things to eat. Utensils, napkins, and seasoning and sauce, hot sauce, ketchups, and all of that. And here. So, that's that. Coffee. I need to bring coffee. Mark, Daddy did your toothpaste, toothpaste already. Go, go put it. Go wash it. Cooking oil, pepper, adobo, salt. Okay. So, Mr. Oops. Oh, Daddy, unplug it. Uh, Mr. Markley. Yeah. What's the most exciting things you looking forward to for your camping? Looking at the stars at uh, night. Sit up, I can't hear you. Looking at the stars. Looking at the stars? Where's the telescope? It's not there. Yeah, I think Daddy left it in the car from last time you went to your auntie. Alright, so ladies and gentlemen, these are empty boxes. Things that we order. That uh, the things like the stove my husband bought came, but this is what we are bringing like cooking stuff. Our clothes is gonna be in it. We're not bringing too many clothes because we plan. Uh uh, do your reading. I told you you're not gonna be doing any school work while we're on the camping trip, so those things need to be done before we leave. Do you understand that? Mm -hmm. So, read. And yesterday, one chapter wasn't enough. Okay, you need to read more. And I will be asking you questions. Do you understand me? So get to it. All right, so what's in here? Uh, we have more stuff we need to sort out, but we have our clothes. We're not bringing too many clothes. Some of the clothes we're gonna be wearing twice, um, except for sleeping clothes. Yeah, sleeping clothes, pajamas. Yeah, so these are empty. We're trying to bring as minimal stuff as possible, but we already bring it. Look, people, this is our first time. Uh, yeah, going literally out of comfort zone. We've camped uh, at my sister-in-law's backyard before, but this time we're going away from civilization. <laughs> so it seems like we're bringing civilization with us, at least for me, that's what I'm thinking. But my husband went berserk, and I wanted to use the, I, gave it to my I guess, sister. the cooking yeah. stuff that they have, how do they call it, grill that they have over there. Um, but he went and buy this. And uh, in terms of cooking stuff, I think this is the only two stuff we're bringing uh, for frying eggs. And if we need to boil water or cook up something, so we'll use that. So that's it for this. And yeah, plus... I showed you guys earlier some of the stuff we're bringing, seasoning, peppers, uh, utensils, and all of the stuff. And we're trying to bring stuff that, um, in terms of utensils, things that we don't use often. We bring plastic uh, forks, except for two spoons, and it's not really good. Uh, it's good quality, but it's not part of the set that we have. It's uh, something we had after my aunt passed away. Things were, you know, going to be thrown away, and I just took these. So that's what we bring it with us. Just two spoons. And uh, yeah. And what today we we gonna before we go shopping, food shopping, I'm gonna go with my husband. Uh, we're gonna buy chicken, eggs. We have eggs in the fridge, but eggs go out really quickly here. So we're gonna buy some more. Uh, what is it? Eggs. I have the list. Um, we bring, we're buying hot dogs, fish, my husband wants fish, bread, and eggs. I already did the seasoning for those things. And uh, before we go buy the stuff, we're going to stop at the uh, Salvation Army and drop off some, uh, let me show you what, actually some of these. But uh, those pens, um, we're going to give away. Okay, like for instance, these are things we're giving away. Toys, I clean their room. These toys are going away. Toys again, giving away. Give away. So the room looks like a mess. These are things I'm giving away. And more stuff to give away. So, yep. So when I said my husband went berserk and buying stuff, so he went and bought this cooler. And he claimed that this cooler, the bottom one, we had these two before. Um, because we're staying two nights and two days, um, he claimed that this could stay for 
48 hours or 78 hours so yeah that's for let's say i think tomorrow we're gonna cook our rice before we leave and any cooking stuff that we uh, gonna preserve gonna be in here so that's why he went and buy this oh lord so yeah i need to take a shower and then i am going like i said food shopping uh drop stuff at the before salvation army food shopping and then i'm going to the gym because I'm not gonna go to the gym while I'm over there. I don't know what I might be doing. It's not there. I don't know where he put it. Um, I'm not sure what I'm gonna be doing in terms of exercise. Like, I don't think we'll be going hiking because I'm not bringing hiking shoes. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna do a good workout today. That's why I didn't go earlier this morning. I got up like four something and uh, I decided not to go um, because I knew my husband was going to be home today and uh, I don't want to get myself too tired and then I won't be able to help him out with all of this stuff. Um, usually after I go to the gym, I need like an hour to like reset. So yeah, yeah, I think that's it. I need to take a shower. There's my gym clothes over there. And, uh, and some of the things that I showed you guys earlier, the toys and stuff like that, they're not going to Salvation Army. I'm gonna keep them uh, to give to my cousin. He ha she has a, a, I think a three or two year old. So some of the toys my kids used to use, I'm passing them to her um, whether or not she needs them they the ones that are broken the toys that are broken we toss them but the good quality ones that my kids are outgrown i'm gonna give it to her so yeah that's it let me go take a shower i know you're probably saying what's taking me so long i went to you get the list no so you got it now right? i went to get it and i went and i got something else and then from getting something else i completely forgot until i went to throw out the garbage so did you get the list? No? I didn't bring it. That's the thing I'm trying to tell you. So what are we going to do? Uh, You'll be fine, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Whatever. Uh, so we'll go to Salvation Army and then... Camping. <laughs> no, uh, to 